And what about you? Um, I would definitely like to focus more time on my family, my husband, and my boys. Okay. Now, what would you like to do with them? Um, I want to have more time, uh, my boys, sporting events, things like that. I want to be more involved in that kind of stuff. Be very specific. Give me a sporting event. Like what? Um, my son's, uh, he does Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, and I miss a lot of those tournaments because they are out of state. So I want to make more time to do that kind of stuff with him. Are you serious? Yes. I don't know if you know this, but... Um, my husband teaches it. I'm tied in with Philadelphia, so I'm a, like, matter of fact, on YouTube right now, my daughter, when she was seven years old, she's on bar in the current UFC nice. uh, champion, Frankie Egger. So again, if your family's into that, I, I'm tied in with some of the m most famous Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu people in the country from the Miglores family. So We're going to New Jersey in a couple weekends. There you I go. I'm determined to be at this one. So. That's what's up. Yes. Okay. Very, very cool. Mm -hmm. And what about you? Um, the balance between life and um, at work and life at home. I mean, that's big, my biggest challenge of having three kids under the age of five <coughs> and then trying to, to work. Um, so I have to prioritize my life, and to do that, I need to sit down and take 15 to 20 minutes on a Sunday or in, on Monday to make sure I make time for my husband and my kids, which I think is number one, and then number two, make sure I do everything at work. Can you um, just give me one, one thing that you'd like to do with your, your kids and your husband? Um, I would like mm -hmm. to just have a nice dinner, sit down, enjoy family, invite everybody over, and just have a good time and dance and laugh. And it's the main thing in life for me. Do you all see why I'm doing this? Again, I want you to say it out loud. I want you to give life to the things that you want. We don't do that enough. We don't we don't get specific and say the things. Like I had to just pull that out of you, but that was awesome. At the very, very end, I felt that that passion of like, you know, it was very vivid. I could so picture dance. it. Yeah, she said dance and laugh. Salsa. Salsa, there you go. Your husband's Puerto Rican, right? Yeah. There you go. Yeah, get down. <laughs> yes, Yvonne is a salsa instructor. Oh, really? Yes. Oh. <laughs> what about you, sir? Uh, I think <clears throat> along the same lines is, is being able to have, you know, uh, to be able to make good plans so that you can be successful at work, so that it frees you up and gives you the, the time and the money to, to, to do the things that you want to do with your family. And, and uh, you know, I think it's you can be successful without having to kill yourself and work 70 hours a week and you know that kind of thing and that's that's where I want to get to okay I'm gonna use you as an example you know what I mean for a couple of different reasons it's my workshop and I can um, you are a general manager of your organization but the name of your organization is Locklear Automotive and your last name is Locklear which means that this is a family thing that's you right. don't it's not the same for certain other people you're not just an employee Whitney, you're in the same situation. I mean, you have a legacy. Like me, I'm new money. I mean, like, I, I just came into this stuff. I mean, like, you have a lot of pressure because, you know, you can't, no disrespect, fuck it up because, I mean, like, you got a whole history. There's a lot of pressure on someone like you, right or wrong. Right. I mean, like, it, because it's not just love of your job. It's love of your family and, and what that means and what you do for the community. That's stressful, man. That's overwhelming. I got stress. I don't got stress like you got stress. It's different stress. How do you deal with that? How do you relax and just decompress? You know, it's it, it's it's a challenge. I mean, that, and that's part of what I think you know we can get out of uh, learning, you know, these kind of tools and stuff is is how to separate the, the two. But you know, it's a balance that you gotta you gotta really make them both work in order to be happy. I you still know, haven't heard it. That's why I'm you, prodding you, gotta, you right now. You gotta be successful. What, but what is it that you do? How do you do? Like, give me just one thing that you can do, if anything. That how do you get away? Even like the president, you know, they gotta go to Camp David. They they sometimes like I, I have enough, and they got a whole country to, you know what I mean. But they're able to step away somehow. Yeah. How do you step away? What is it? Give me one thing that you do that just allows you to just escape, even if it's just for a couple hours. What well, do you do? I, I, I like to cook. You know, so, so see, that's can, real. If I can yeah. be, I would have never thought that, brother, yeah. for real. If I can okay, be good. Home and, yeah. And cook with my family. And What's your favorite food to cook? Uh, anything on the grill. Anything on the grill? Yeah. Yeah. yeah I like huh? Look at that. I like I like cooking a lot on the grill. And, we coming over for a bomb. Yeah. Go <laughs> 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 Green egg. Alabama. Yeah. Okay. So uh, anytime you can do that with with, 
with family and friends, and you know, it's just it's relaxing and fun. You know. That see, that's the type of stuff I want to hear. I want to hear real stuff that that it makes sense. We're all people, man. And again, if we don't unplug, we're gonna implode. You feel me? That's good. Okay, Fani, where are we at? I think I just I want to learn how to organize and prioritize my life, um, work and home. Um, like example, my son just turned 18, so mm -hmm. he's getting his own life. He's doing his own thing. I want to spend a little more quality time with him. Um, not so much quantity time because, like I said, he has his own life, college, work, whatever, but quality time. Okay. Yeah. Now, um, elaborate on the quality. What would be something really awesome to do? Something awesome to do with him would, to me, and, mm -hmm. and he also is just like we just got we just got a new pup. Take the puppy to the beach. The puppy's name. Just Viper. Viper. <laughs> Viper. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Okay. Um, just take him to the beach, let him run, and just walk and talk. Just okay. walk and talk with my son. Just that's real. That's awesome. Okay, cool. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna come back to you guys a little bit, huh? I say, okay, <laughs> okay. What about you, Andre? Uh, the main thing is, is not to be repetitive, but family. You know, I got an 18 year old who lives in Pittsburgh and a two year old, but I don't really have enough time to spend with him. And at the same time. I need to be able to spend time so they can get to know each other. You know, I mean, right. like, you know my older son only see my younger son once, so I need to find the time in order to do that. Okay. Now, what type of activities would you like to do with them? I mean, just even just take them on vacation. Just us three, you know, whatever. Just just regular everyday stuff. Can I just give you one little tip? Uh -huh. Stay away from the jet skis. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> 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 he was with me in Puerto Rico. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and for you, sir? To, um, devote more time to my family. You yeah, know, you gotta spend more time. It's just hard to t it's hard to make time in this business. Ah, I want you to say it loud. Why don't people lift weights? <laughs> loud people because they're freaking heavy. <laughs> they're freaking freaking heavy. Thank you. Same thing over here. What you said is, I know it's hard, but life is hard. You've got to You've got to turn on and, and make time for it. Do you know what I'm saying? You've got to. I hear it all the time. Yes. People tell me that all the time. Got to. All right. Thank you very much.